fight week? How are you feeling? I feel super healthy, super excited for my first fight in a PFL, and this will be explode, big bump in a Saturday night. What was the biggest reason that kind of got you excited to sign for the PFL? Uh, what is the reason? I think I was a long time in a UFC. Uh, I have a little problems with the hilt, but everything is right now is very, very good, and I'm super healthy. And I just want to try something different, you know, different category, different organization, better man. Are you excited to kind of be um, in a situation where you know kind of when you're going to fight, you know, there's a season, you know, when you're not going to fight, there's an off season? Is that something that kind of... Yeah, absolutely, because I like to have plans for everything. So now I know how to, how to like, planning my all year, and I'll be, like, just with the shape in the all year. How does your year kind of look if you're looking ahead? Where do you see yourself by the end of the season? I see myself as a new champion in the PFL. That's why I come here, to be the champion, and nobody stopped me. And what did you think of your opponent when you got the name? What was your first thought? Uh, I know about my opponent, like, uh, I don't know, maybe it's four weeks before. They were switching all the time for me. Uh, but it was no problem. I was all the time with the hard training. So I have like four weeks to look at him and check him. He's fighting a little bit like a karate style. Uh, big dude, tall. Uh, but I don't think so. He's that experienced. He don't fight with people how I fight in my art career. So I think it would be a very excited fight. Thank you. Your opponent, Amari, was, was, was supposed to fight Will first. Did he help you at all with um, stuff? Uh, I don't see Omari because I think he got injured his knee, so he don't come to us g our gym. I think he will stay in Russia, get recovery from his knee, so we don't see each other. One of the big storylines in the PFL light heavyweight division is there might be, f there could be five American top team fighters fighting in this division. So have you kind of talked to each other about fighting each other? Yes. Uh, like in the beginning, I tell the story, I was supposed to fight with Joe Silverio in the first fight. But it was a little bit like, you know, I mean, I'm first, first fight in the PFL, and uh, I don't want to fight first fight with, it, with my teammates. So thank God they switch, and now I fight with somebody who I don't know. So if you do get matched up in the future, is that something that you talk about before it happens? Yeah, we talk and uh, we know this can happen, you know, it's like you say, before it was five people, Zapato, Antonio Carlos Jr., Omari, Josh, me, Mareta, so it was a lot of people for a tournament. How many people is in the tournament? Like 16 people, so I know we can fight each other, but this is just business. We don't have a problem with each other, so. Good luck. Thanks. With the PFL system, when you're getting scored, depending on how the performance of your, your fight, how do you see that? Changing maybe your fight style and how you approach each fight? Uh, of course, everybody want the six points, but I don't press myself to get six points. I do what I can to do in this fight. Of course, I want to win this fight and i going to win this fight, but I don't know. I can't control this how I win this. Chris, thank you for taking the time. You fought in Vegas before. Just tell us how was the camp for this fight? How prepared are you? Yeah, I fight in Vegas, I think my last three or four fights. Uh, but this fight, I was prepared with a very, very tough guys. Uh, with, I think, one of the best middleweight, Johnny Eblin. Uh, I train also with uh, Bo Nico, the wrestling star in the UFC. Uh, Bruno Assi is like, I have very, very high level sparring partner this time. So um, I'm ready, ready to go. Excellent, sir. And last for me, you touched on the health issues before. Is there anything that you can share with us that you were able to uh, I don't want to share too much. Okay. It's like my opponent will be know what happens. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Uh, was a lot of issues, but I'm, I'm ready to go right now. I already forgot about everything, and I just want to smoke. Excellent. Thank you, sir. Good luck. Appreciate Thanks. It. Hey, well, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, hey, uh, Christoph. Uh, so you had the opponent change to Will. Would you just uh, repeat one more time about how you felt about that change? Uh, I'm fighting so long. 
in the sport, so it doesn't matter for me who I fight, you know what I mean? I fight with the best people in the UFC for for nine years, so it doesn't matter who I fight there. I be, can fight with everybody. Um, and uh, Will, Will, he's a guy from uh, Ireland. Are you going to have a beer with him after the fight? Has it been a friendly thing with you guys? Or? Uh, yeah, I see him. Like, I always see my opponent. I don't know, but I have some... Something like every time I come to the hotel, first what I see, I see my opponent. So I see him, we shake hands, we cool each other, uh, but in a cage, he don't be my friend. I just want to kick his ass. And, but after, of course, I like to drink too, so we can drink, no problem. Who, uh, who would you say drinks more? I'm sure you're biased, but the Irish people or the Polish people? One more time? Who, yeah, who, who, who more? Uh, who can like handle more, the Irish people or the Polish? Uh, I'm sure you're biased, right? I think it's uh, hard to say, but I think Polish people, they can drink more. I've seen some stuff. Thank you. Everybody go with questions? Uh, Chris, up right here. How do you feel about the Polish MMA scene growing continuously? And uh, is there any Polish athlete or someone you look up to from Poland? Uh, I think the Polish people right now, Polish fighters, they hit the level, and you can see in a UFC on the different organization, uh, we're good. And maybe I think before it was like maybe scary, scary to and no confidence to fight with America with the different people. But now I think we we know we're in the same level and we fight good. Thank you. Everybody all set? Yeah, thank you. We are thank good you. to go. You're free to, free to leave. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.